Salut coders, welcome to another YouTube tutorial. In this tutorial, we are continuing with our Stripe integration, and here we are talking about subscription. So let's get started. What do you know about subscription? A subscription is when on your platform you want to have a recurring payment, either on this example, you see we have four dollars for a monthly and eight dollars for a monthly, and this is the pro. So you have your products that is different prices each for each month. So Stripe will offer you the subscription for you. So you create subscription here. They're talking about create and manage subscription, recurring payments and recurring revenue with the Stripe billing API. So you must know about the subscription objects that is offered by, by Stripe. So with subscriptions, customers make recurring payments for access to a product. Subscriptions require you to retain more information about your customers than one-time purchases do because you need to charge customers in the future. So like you on Netflix, you most of you I think you have Netflix accounts and each month they take three dollars, they take three dollars, nine dollars, depends. On the subscription that you have each subscription has its own advantages maybe uh, with nine dollars you are allowed to use three devices with fifteen dollars five devices so and six and six and six so that's where subscription comes in whereby each month is a fixed fee is taken from your payment method so what is a product this is what your business offers so it's either a $9 product, a $15 product, or what is the price? This is the amount that you'll be charged. So each product has its own amount and its own current. So with Stripe, each product is a, is a, is a price that you, and the currents, either Euro, USD, Yen, ETC. Then we say we have a customer. Stripe customer allow you to perform recurring charges for the same customer and to track multiple charges. So you create a customer so that and we link that customer to a payment method. So what is a payment method? Your customers payment instruments, how they pay your services. For example, credit card. A credit card is an example of a payment method that we, we are going to use. So then later on, we have a subscription, the product detail associated with the plan that the customer subscribed. So you subscribed for a $9, $9 product. So that's the associated plan for a customer have to subscribe. Then we have an invoice, a statement of amounts owed by a customer. They track the status of payment from draft through paid or otherwise finalized. So you have an invoice and Stripe offers all this. Uh, this invoice for you can be sent to a, to a customer. So on our development, we are going to have this flow. First thing, we want to create a payment method. Means we want to create a card with a, so our request shall have a, a card number, expiry date, expiry month and the CVC. So we create a payment a payment method. After creating payment method, we create a customer. Then after creating a customer, we attach the payment method to a customer. The payment method means the card that we already created, the credit card, we attach it to a customer. If it's success, we then create a subscription. Whereby a subscription, this is the, the, uh, the, the object that will be charged each month and associated with a with a product. So each month, if it's a monthly yearly, a user a, a amount like five dollars is being debited from the account automatically. So this is the payment method Java code that we are going to use. So when creating a payment method on our wash map, these are the common fields that you must send a number which is a credit card number, expiry month, either um, it's um, 
07 like June uh, expiry 2020 2023 means June 2023 and C CVC uh, for your card and also you say then you create the these are the parameters parameters that are required for a payment methods these are pay, payment payment method params whereby the type is a card because we are creating payment method of a card and we put a card these are the card details the number experiment that means that we passed so then you say payment method dot create we pass these params to create a customer it's easy we only need this uh, these three fields the name of the cast the name so you send a username the email and also the payment method means the payment method that we that we get from the previous uh, the id that we get here so we need that payment method so after that we want to attach that payment method we want to attach a, a payment method uh, uh, to a customer so this is the this is it in the customer you put the parameter of the customer customer id then on payment method you attach the customer so creating a subscription so in a subscription we have to pass a subscription a price a price id so i will show you how to create a how to create a how to create this product and the way to get this price id so you get it on the dashboard for stripe so we need the price id then the quantity is this subscription for one person if it's for one person you just put one and we have to create also another parameter parameter hash map param, parameters whereby we put a custom id a payment method which is the payment method that we uh, that we that we created before in the items a list of items then you say subscription dot create so that's all so a subscription id will be created so after doing this you have to save these details on your database and you can use that subscription in future when someone needs to to uh, want to unsubscribe to that subscription or a user want to upgrade so you must have a reference of a, of a subscription id it's important so if you want to delete a subscription or unsubscribe you just say subscription you, you must first retrieve based on the id that you saved on your database then you say subscription dot cancel then it means you are cancelling the subscription so next month a user is not uh, there's no is not uh, there's no debiting of the card or the payment method so that's all from this video coders thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share subscribe and click the notification bell so that you are notified whenever i upload a new video salut coders let's meet on the next video where we do our Java development.